Ever thought about letting AI handle your homework? Maybe write your essays, crack your math problems, or just do it all for you. If you're nodding, you're not alone. But here's the thing. What if I told you that doing this is literally rewiring your brain in ways that could sabotage your future success? Your brain works like a network of highways that get stronger with use. When you struggle through problems, you're literally building new neural pathways, your brain's superpower called neuroplasticity. But when you use shortcuts to get answers without thinking, it's like having someone else steer push-ups while you watch. Your neural pathways don't get built. The connections that help you think critically, solve problems, and remember information don't form. Scientists call this desirable difficulty, when you're working hard enough that it feels challenging, but not impossible. This is when your brain grows strongest. So when you let AI write your essay, you're missing out on building the neural networks for critical thinking, clear communication, and problem-solving, skills you'll need for life, not just this assignment. Academic integrity means doing your own work, citing sources when using others' ideas, not copying from classmates or the internet, being clear about what help you had, and following assignment rules, including any on AI use. AI tools can be helpful when used right. For example, this video was created using an AI avatar to enhance the visual and audio, but the content and the script were written by a human. The key is understanding using AI as a learning tool versus using AI for doing the learning for you. Using AI as a learning partner can sometimes be okay, depending on the assignment and syllabus rules. It can help you with brainstorming ideas, explaining confusing concepts, organizing your thoughts, studying for exams, and practicing languages. Using AI as a crutch is not okay. Examples of this include writing your essay, solving homework problems for you, taking quizzes or tests, researching without you checking sources, and generating work you submit as your own. But every class has different rules. So how do you figure out what's okay and what's not? This brings us to your syllabus. Be sure to fully understand academic integrity policies, acceptable tools, and AI rules. If you're not sure about something, ask. Professors would rather clarify now than deal with misconduct later. Some good questions are, can I use AI for brainstorming? If I use AI for grammar checks, should I cite that? What resources are allowed on this assignment? Can we collaborate and if so, how? Understanding and following your syllabus and assignment policies are critical as academic integrity slip-ups can hurt both in the short term and in the long term. Consequences can include failing the assignment or course, academic probation, school suspension, lost scholarships, and damaged relationships with professors. Worst of all, shortcuts hold back your brain's growth. When you let AI do the work, you lose the chance to get smarter, more confident, and capable. So how do you navigate this world of AI and academic pressure while still building those crucial neural pathways? Strategy one, embrace the struggle. When you hit a tough problem, don't immediately ask AI. Sit with the confusion. This is your brain getting stronger. Strategy two, use AI as a tutor, not a replacement. Don't ask, write my essay. Instead ask, help me understand this topic so I can write about it. Strategy three, can you teach it? If you cannot explain something clearly to someone else, you need to go deeper. One way to do this is to ask the AI to explain a concept to you like you're a five-year-old. Strategy four, process over product. Assignments aren't just about getting the right answers. They're about building your thinking skills. Don't shortcut your brain from learning. When you're struggling, reach out for legitimate help. You can do this by emailing your instructor, visiting office hours, going to tutoring centers, or working in study groups. Asking for help isn't cheating, it's being smart. Bottom line, every time you do the hard thinking work, you build mental muscle for life. Every shortcut keeps you mentally weak. Your future boss will want someone who can actually think and solve problems. So here is your action plan. Read every syllabus and ask questions. Use AI as a learning partner, not a replacement. Embrace the struggle. It makes your brain stronger. Seek help when needed from professors and tutors. Remember, academic integrity isn't just about rules. It's investing in yourself. Your education is the best investment you'll make. Don't shortchange yourself. 
You got this.